rigorous, rigorous, hey. rigorous. Can't get him looking rigorous. My champagne, but I'm rigorous. My campaign looking rigorous. Whole team hella rigorous. Lifestyle so rigorous. Hairstyle so rigorous. Your top five ain't rigorous. If you left out this rigorous, 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 rigorous. Me and my niggas is rigorous. Good morning, guys. It is 6 a.m. Welcome back to Mom Banza. By 6 a.m. I mean 6 in the morning. Your six or six in all because i'm just trying to be a good friend so george gave me a call the other day asking me to come on his radio show apparently they're doing a housewarming for him if you didn't know and you haven't watched sushi with wasabi recently they recently got an apartment they are moving in together yo what a wonderful day the only thing that sucks is that george's radio show starts in the morning i actually think it started over an hour ago but they only asked me to be there at 7 a.m so that's what i'm doing i'm currently wearing a two-piece they asked us to wear pajamas um and i don't know any self-respecting zulu man that has pajamas on hand so i'm wearing my uh, levi's two-piece because it kind of looks like pajamas also i'm lying i do have pajamas they're in the bag but that's beside the point according to ways if i leave right now i will arrive at seven o'clock on the dot so let's go <music> Okay, oh, okay, I'm clean. Okay, wasabi is not okay. Yeah, yeah. But that dance is by Batista, man. Shout out. Wonderful. Yeah, wonderful. Thank you so so much to everyone that came through today. Thank Candace Mutisele, Robot Boy. Thanks so much to Lula Odiba as well as Caddy Sibumpanza. Thank you so much for joining us, Dali. Thanks so much for joining us and for helping us celebrate Wasabi and his brand new. You know, moment, adventure. Yes, yes, How are you yes. feeling now? Never again, but it was nice. It was nice. <laughs> it was nice, but never again. But that's the thing is, when you're on the way up, it's important to celebrate these moments. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. exactly. exactly. Yeah. But I'm not telling you about my next apartment. <laughs> no, you have to. Nah, I'm posting it privately. Private, close friends. Ah, uh, uh, why? And I'm removing you guys from my close friends. No. So, George invited us to his house for one thing, but now he's making us build his uh, furniture. He's got robot boy building furniture. That's when you know a man has clout. <laughs> when you have robot boy building your furniture. There's an instruction manual, but I kind of hate instruction manuals because, but you put one with one, put two with two, and here there's like 15 different screws. Let's start there. But at least we've got the biggest handyman in the world. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> like, have you have seen the size of his hands. So, you know. They hate you. Are you right there, Robert? I'm very worried about what you're doing. My man, I'm online. Okay. I'm the guy you need on your team out an amazing grace for a survivor. <laughs> understand. What did you do then? You said, did you take this apart? Um, two, two and two and three. Two and three. Yeah. Yes, three. I'm number three. Man, I'm a supervisor. Yeah. That's one and same. I'm for me. Two, three. Oh. Yeah, three. Oh, okay, okay, okay. okay. Understand. Okay. Exhibit A. <laughs> <laughs> It doesn't happen. Yes. We supervise a So um we built George's cabinet. The only problem is one of the rods, two of them so So the problem is Yeah, that's how it's supposed to be. So. Yeah. Yeah. Right, 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 right. <laughs> this nah, next, 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 next. We're just covering our work, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll explain to you guys later. Don't worry. So, uh, where were we last? Oh, I was at George's house last week for his housewarming. Uh, that was the first time that I was actually inside George's apartment, and it is beautiful robot boy and i didn't fully explain what was happening because we didn't want to be too loud basically what happened is george asked us to build a cabinet for him like a shelf thing and uh, we didn't build it properly we built it like 98 percent correctly but in about two years it's gonna fall over so george if you're seeing this 
get medical aid. It's a Friday, which means it's weekend time. I'm in such a positive mood. Speaking of positive moods, I saw you guys' comments in my latest video. I was reading them this morning, and a lot of you guys were talking about how happy you think I am and how content you think I am, and I am. I am. You, you're right. I am happy. I am content. Incredibly so, actually. A lot of stuff is going right in my life. And you know, there will always be problems and issues. That's just part of being an adult. That's just part of being human. But overall, like, relative to everything that's going on in the world and what's happened in my past, I am in a, in a pretty good place, you know? Could I be better? Yes always definitely am i way better than i was last year two years ago three years ago five, ten years ago whatever yes yes i am i'm exercising i'm in the best shape of my life i'm sleeping well i'm sleeping on the same day that i wake up do you get me like i wake up today and i will sleep tonight not tomorrow morning which is what i used to do work is good you know i've got a tv show on sabc i've got a podcast i'm uploading youtube videos speaking of this video right now is my 10th video this year just on this youtube channel which means i have now officially uploaded more youtube videos in may than i have the whole year last year well not in may by may the whole year last year i'm pretty sure i uploaded I think eight videos and I've uploaded nine and it's still May. So yes, I am very good. I've got a beautiful home. I've got a car that works most of the time. My love life, um, <clears throat> I've actually got a date tonight. So I got, I got them flowers for the date. Look, look at that. I'm keeping them in a vase for now, but I'll obviously take them out. Also the whole flowers thing, I don't understand how to do it at a restaurant. Do you take the flowers to the restaurant? Do you give them the flowers before and then they leave them at home and then you go to the restaurant? Because when you get to the restaurant, do you, uh, where do you put the flowers? Like flowers need water, otherwise they're gonna die. Yes, they're not gonna die in five minutes, but if they've been sitting out for a long time, they're not gonna last very long and flowers can be quite expensive. How, how does it work? Anyway, I've got a little space for a note here at the back. I'm probably just gonna write, yeah, clever, so she doesn't think Diam Funa over, even though, Diam Fun. <clears throat> I'm actually ruining the packaging a bit here at the bottom, but hopefully it won't be too bad. But yeah, overall, things are pretty good. Things are very good, actually. Um, I'm in a very good place, and I hope that this lasts for a very, very long time. I don't feel like I'm doing too bad for a 28-year-old, you know? Speaking of things going well, recently I've been able to uh, DJ more, like play around with it more, uh, practice more. And so I kind of finally decided to make mixes to upload on YouTube, and I'm going to be uploading them on Mombanza. The problem is I've been sitting on one, the first one right now for a few hours and I, I can't convince myself to press publish. I can't convince myself to, to press publish so that it goes live, so that you guys can see it and share it and listen to it and whatever. It is stressing me out. It feels like when I uploaded my first YouTube video, I, I, I can't convince myself to do it. It's literally sitting there. It's been sitting there for ages. Um, I'm just scared, you know, I'm scared of putting myself out there. I'm scared of getting ridiculed. I'm scared of looking stupid. I'm scared of being bad at something. Uh, but at the same time, I know that if I don't actually start, then I'll never get better. Uh, it's literally right there. Title, thumbnail, I did everything, but it's not public. You guys can't see it. Right now, you can't see it. Um, hopefully, if the best version of myself wins this inner argument that I'm having, you guys would have already listened to it. You know what? It's fine. I'm going to upload it. I'm going to upload it. And if you guys hate it, it's fine. I'll just go jump off Nelson Mandela Bridge. So I woke up today and decided to go plant shopping. Um, I, I think before I fell asleep yesterday on Instagram, I got like an ad for a plant place. And I got really excited because I've been wanting new plants. And um, yeah, this morning I woke up and decided I'm gonna go do that. But then I actually researched where it was and it was in Kempton Park and it's like very far away. Um, it was too much of a drive. So I ended up Googling another place and then I found out that at 44 Stanley, there is a plant shop called, where's my phone? There's a plant shop called JFF Plant Shop. Um, it's at 44 Stanley Mall Park. And I went in there, it's a little bit small, but 
I was still very happy with the range of selection of plants. I wanted a banana leaf plant, a very long one, but unfortunately they didn't have one. They told me that I could order it though, which I probably will do at a certain point, but I still left with these babies. I got this guy over here. Um, it's quite a, it's quite a massive, massive plant. Um, could be bigger, obviously. It's not, it's not really that tall. I think it's like, this is as high as it goes, a little bit higher, and it's sitting on a table right now. So it's not huge, but you know, for the plants that I do have, it's much bigger than all the other ones that I have. I got two of these, and then I got a variation of this, which was this one. How beautiful is this one? It's like dark and moody, and um, I hope I don't kill it, because I think it is a very, very beautiful plant. Um, I'm going to still add onto my selection. This is just me starting afresh, starting anew. Um, but yeah, put me in a good mood, man. I just decided, wake up, let's go do some plant shopping, get some new babies, put them around the house and we'll see. Obviously, I still have to get a vase. They're not called vases. What are they called? A pot. pot. A pot, pot, plot, pot. Yes, it's a, it's, it's like a pot, pot. Yes, that is what it is, right? A rice on a rice, a rain also on a rice. Yeah. What the heck? I'll probably get those in the next few weeks, but for now I don't really mind that they're just sitting in the, you know, black pots that they came with. Um, it's all cool with me. Oh, I must say though that yesterday. Um, I posted the DJ mix and then I left and I didn't look at the comments for a few hours or the the likes and the, the views or whatever because I was just oh I was so stressed but lo and behold I went back um, to look at the comments and to look at the likes and whatever and you guys have left the loveliest comments you guys are posting it on Instagram like yeah it's a lot it's it's a lot um and i'm very i'm just very thankful to you guys i think you already know that but i just have to say it one more time so i appreciate that i'm definitely going to upload a mix again this friday um i'm hoping to upload them every friday so that you guys can listen to them over the weekend and obviously as much as you want after that but i do greatly appreciate it because i was putting myself out there it is very nerve-wracking um and I, I i haven't had that feeling in a very very long time um so it was very difficult to overcome it but i'm glad i did with the, a lot of support um from you guys and my friends and yeah i really appreciate it i'm gonna go find a home for these plants around the house probably won't be there forever home but uh we'll see we'll see what they do for the house for now i'll see you guys later